Namaste, welcome to the space, any wellness on your journey. This one gonna be for Libra. Hopefully I can help you out, Libra, with this message. Okay, so let's get the message for Libra at this time. What's coming out for Libra? Holy Spirit, angels and guides. What's coming out for Libra at this time? So we got 10th house energy for you right now, Libra. Um, some sort of financial constraints right now, coming up right now. You could be receiving a gift. Your birthday could have just passed or whatever. Some of my Libras here. What is this? Consistent. Okay. You could be thinking about God more lately, the most high more lately. You know, you'd be wanting to be more consistent with that relationship here for a uh, Libra. Tell me more for Libra. Okay, Libra, there's something here about you releasing regrets right now. Okay. Yeah, wow. And I also see out um Sagittarius significant here for you, Libra, at this time. You can have that in your chart or it could be a person in your life. Somebody's an earth angel, okay, Libra. Endure, okay. Spiritual vitality. What is this here? <clears throat> for Libra at this time. Okay, yeah. So they're saying here with your obstacles, these financial constraints, your obstacles are being lifted at this time for you. Libra. Okay, you could be getting a gift. Libra, it says. All your good personal work and your positive energy shift will overcome. I'm sorry, I can't see that. What these dots? Will overcome previous obstacles and blocks are lifted away. You will now experience progress and forward movement with your progress, with your projects. Stay centered in gratitude to ensure that your flow of abundance continues. Stay thankful because I feel like, yeah be like you paying off debt or just paying off things or kind of getting things in order for yourself right now okay financially whatever those block blockages that you could have been experiencing here Libra are being lifted what is the most high consistent take divinely guided take a divinely guided chance the most high is saying take a divinely guided chance, okay? Some sort of good karma, positive energy you've been putting out there, okay? It's paying off for you, Libra. All positive change and successful ventures involve a degree of risk. If you're ready to follow your divine guidance to new territories, as you leave behind that which is comfortable and familiar but no longer appropriate for you, you make room for new and more meaningful opportunities, Libra. Okay, so just stay consistent if you are doing that already. Okay. What is regrets here for Libra? Libra, regrets. Okay, savings. Okay. So if you want to save more, I feel like, you know, take take a leap, take a, a risk, you know, to do that, whatever that is, okay? Don't be afraid to do that, to take a risk, to save more, okay? Put your future forward, you know, think about your future or something like that as well for you, Libra. I don't know, that's what's coming out. Yeah, we also got our expectations, spiritual vitality. It's I'm getting like there's a specific relationship or something like that with you and a specific earth angel in your life. I don't know who this is. It could be a possible Sagittarius. It doesn't have to be, but it could be anybody, right? But just somebody very special. It's like you have a very special connection with somebody, and this person is very spiritual, and they are helping you to have some sort of success in the future or something like that. I'm picking that up too. We got windfall of abundance, okay? An increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms. Some of them are unexpected, 
Libra. Be open to receiving and know that this abundance comes to you as support for your life purpose, health, and charitable work. Okay. Somebody like thinks of you highly is what I'm getting here. Because whenever I get that card, I know what that means. Okay. Somebody thinks of you highly. They love the fuck out of you. And they, somebody wants to give you a gift. Okay. Bigger than um, <clears throat> kind of what you can measure. You know, something to really help you out. Right. That's what I'm getting here. Okay. So there's that for you, Libra. But let's dig a little deeper. Okay. What do we got? What's coming out for Libra? What is Mercury placements, financial insurance? Yeah, so there's some sort of temptation, something that's blocking you here. There's some sort of temptation here with the devil that's blocking you right now, Libra, as far as like, damn, you want to save, but you're really addicted to this. So you're really tempted by spending your money this way, right? There's that for you, okay? Yeah, that's <laughs> that's what I'm <laughs> <laughs> okay and then you isolate because you know it's like something you know that you should be kind of letting go of and then I'm also getting to you know maybe you looking at this and realizing like okay maybe this is something I need to let go of so I can stop regretting you know, doing it and just stop doing it or something like that, right? I don't know is what I'm getting for you. That is sad. Yeah, high priestess. Because it's like you know you need to change or fix something here is what I see for you right now, Libra. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing for you right now, Libra. Because I feel like it's a burden for you to even do something right now, like, in your life, like financial stuff is like something that you you feel like burdened by it takes a lot out of you financially is what it is is whatever this temptation is right um you feel burdened by it you feel like the suffering or the pain or something from it is starting to affect you now okay it may be something <laughs> that you could have let go of in the past or just overlooked and like now it matters more okay the more and more that you've kind of tried to um, escape from that, right? Because that's what the devil represents also, you know, escapism. So, <clears throat> what is this? <clears throat> Take a divinely guided chance for Libra right now. Take a divinely guided chance. What is that for Libra? Whoa. Okay. So, yeah, you could be wanting to venture out and do new things or whatever, but you also feel like... You may not have the confidence or something like that, okay? Or like something to that effect here with the four of wands. Yeah, I'm seeing you being successful because you got the six of pentacles energy. You know, if you do take like a risk, I see you being successful with that risk. Some sort of good karma paying off or some sort of consistency. Maybe somebody might know you word of mouth. I'm also hearing that here with the six of pentacles. What is this for uh, Libra at this time? Yeah, justice. Wow. Even though it's in reverse, I do see you getting like justice here. You know, <clears throat> if you put in some sort of hard work, you know. Or not hard work, but if you put in some sort of consistency here is what I'm seeing. Yeah, I also see like you have like ancestors or relatives that support you. You know, the most high here, you know, they support you. You know, um, your ancestors, your guides, those who uh, walk before you, uh, Libra, at this time, they are definitely heavy, you know, in your energy. And they, they really, you know, helping you to overcome something or to have a better connection here with source or um something like that with your karma here i'm seeing that for you as well okay so what is savings for libra at this time Whoa. Yeah, I see you like um, 
if you are saving, I see like it being a good thing for you at some point or like paying off, you know, so you don't regret something. Okay, with this Eight of Pentacles, like maybe in the past you um, planted a seed to care for your future or something like that. And now, you know, that, that shit might really come up, you know, and you're going to look back, you know, I feel like your your um, future self is going to look back and say, damn, I'm glad you did that, you know, for yourself. Right, there's that with savings. I'm seeing that for you, Libra. I'm sure glad you did that, Libra, you know. So, I don't know. There's something about savings for you. <clears throat> and this could even be like you investing in somebody else. And then, like, later on, it paying off. Because it's like somebody might remember you later on with this seven of coins. And then they might return the favor is what I'm seeing for some of you guys. Because it's like you have... You have ancestors in this earth angel in the most high. Like, you got, like, spirits fucking with you, like, heavy, Libra, okay? You don't understand. That's what this windfall of abundance is about. Hello? It's like a little Santa Claus coming and passing out gifts because you was deserving, right? Ain't that how the story go? Oh, okay. But, yeah. So, you got the two of pentacles. There's something that you definitely, you know, maybe have a difficulty with of letting, you know, letting go, you know, of something. But I feel like you will eventually, you know, just hopefully it's sooner than later, because I feel like it, it's a big regret for you. You know what I'm saying? And as long as you regret it, you already know you halfway there, you know, to stopping or releasing something or whatever the fuck it is. Okay. <clears throat> That's what I'm getting for you, Libra. I love you, bye.